I just did an interview with Jay Stone. That's wow. powerful from bro. Six O. That's powerful. Wow. I just want to, you know what I'm saying? The interview wasn't that long. I just wanted to see y'all, let y'all can see us talking. That's you know what I'm powerful. saying? And communicating uh, amongst each other. Have you met him before? And, no, I have never met him before. Wow. Wow. And that shit was just, it was cool just to sit there with somebody, you know what I'm saying? Use this platform and let people know that. You know, we can communicate with each other as black men, even though you're from the other side. I'm from over here. And that's what we, you know, we can do. I mean, I do clown about the C-Mac shit or whatever the case may be, but that's just one individual. You feel me? Like, it's, there's other individuals out here that I can get along with and function with, you know what I'm saying, and talk to. So, yeah, that's going to be a cool one, man, for y'all to see. That's powerful. And you got to be... Yeah. You got to be level-headed, man, when it comes down to it. It don't matter really where you're from. It's like, yeah. literally, like... Everybody, because we all got burnt homies who you can never put in the same rooms. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Nobody. You know what I'm saying? Like The Cagapalos. So Mexicans say that, yeah. Like, oh, Calapalos. The Calapalos. The Calapalos. Like, like, there's that one homie that comes in and just fucks up everything. You can't take him to a party. Yeah. You can't take him to uh, an yeah, event because sure. he thinks everybody's tripping on him. That's a Cagapalo. Yeah. I be learning a lot from you, bro. Cagapalo. Cagapalo. So when you're homies acting dumb, just be like, you're a Cagapalo, fool. Cagapalo? Nah, nigga nah. might trip. Like, what you mean I'm a Cagapalo? <laughs> yeah. For real. Like, what, you, what the hell you mean? You the know fuck what is that? That's dope, though, bro. That's dope that he did that, for real. Yeah, yeah. That's, that's real power. That's when tight, I seen uh, it, I, that's, that's like... Damn. Like, I don't think the No Jumper fans are going to get it, but that's like... That's like... Legendary. Equivalent to like... You know, like like y'all homies when Nip died going over there, and you feel me, and just walking yeah. together. It's like, damn, you don't see shit like that. So even to have a, you know what I'm saying, a nigga from Hoover and a nigga from fucking Six O, my nigga, even able to talk, and homies is gonna be able to be like, oh, it's cool for them to watch that. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Like that's that's because how this business is shit. bring you together. You yeah. feel me? People need to take care of their families. People have families, yeah. like, yeah. and people grow. You be like so we have to show that like we can't be always out here like oh beef 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 like it ain't yeah. like that all the time bro like so holla at me feel me like yeah. like let's 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 talk it out let's see what it do you feel me like, so how did that come about you set that up or i Adam's... definitely hit that nigga up you feel me i'm, I'm a real you, nigga oh, wow i'm a real one you feel I'm, me I'm, like i'm gonna let y'all know i really am i'm proud me? of you because that's brave bro <laughs> that's super it brave. can go the other way yeah, you know what i'm saying sure. yeah. a nigga be like look at this nigga right here post you try oh, to ass nigga. try to smudge you out <laughs> Yeah. Do all types of sure. co ass nigga want to interview a bitch <laughs> ass nigga trying to you know what I'm saying? <laughs> but it's all good. Yeah. But when it and even when it come down to that, bro, you don't even know what you're doing. You showing the youth like, all right, maybe I can get along with this person, and that's gonna make the whole city like bigger and better. You feel me? Yeah, I definitely reached out. He answered, and and boom, we made it happen. I mean, we did what we could. You feel me for the for the culture for sure. That's tight. Oh God, it was tight. It was tight. When I was sitting there, I'm like, this shit is crazy. Yeah. <laughs> oh God, it sure. you feel me? Yeah, different. Hell, yeah, it was yeah. a couple of times where I was lost. I'm like, I don't even know what the fuck to say to this nigga. I'm just, <laughs> we could just be up here and take some flicks for these motherfuckers. You feel yeah. me? And put it out. So yeah. what's your what's your plan now when it comes down to like all the interviews? Like like where you see that shit like like expanding to, and who are you open to? Like who you want on this motherfucker? Like. As far as the biggest person I would like to talk to, probably is like Kanye and Jay Z. If I would have, have you know, but That's but fine. any, but I can speak to anybody. Like I don't give a fuck. You know what I'm saying? I, I want to interview and speak to people and see what to do. You feel me? Get yeah. the other side. I just feel like us in in general, we bring out another part of people. Oh, yeah, like, yeah, yeah, for sure. Like it's and, like homie vibes, though. Yeah, it was yeah. kind of like. It was like we you could really see that shit when Mozzie was sitting right here. Like mm -hmm. we brought out the the best Mozzie yeah. interview ever to me. You feel yeah. me? For sure. Standing up, crazy, nah, laughing, yeah, yeah. joking. He said that too. Because right? feel me? Like, like niggas segment. called me was yeah. like, bro, I ain't never seen him in that light. Like you feel yeah. comfortable. Like like comfortable. most most hood niggas joke around, play around all day. They some of the funniest niggas. You but know what I'm saying? They're different. Well, it's, it it depends. No, no, but that's what I'm saying. Like he showed out. He. He's shown both sides of him before. Like, he's done the series interviews, and then he came in here and just fucking did his shit. Yeah. Was clowning, but talking just, shit. That's what, that's what makes this show different than, you feel me, Adam interviewing you. You feel me? Because it's like, you you come in here to talk to Adam, you're going to come here on some rap shit. You feel me? You're going to keep it doing it. Like, well, that's why, like, we can have the same type of guests. You, I want you to come there at the end of the day to feel like you at home. You want yeah. the homeboys. You ain't even got to get too deep into nothing. Yeah. My nigga just... 
just kick back. You know what I'm saying? That's what a lot of the viewers say too. They say they be at home like feeling like they were just just with the homies, like one of the boys and shit. Yeah. Okay, guys, we want to thank you so so much for getting us to a hundred thousand subscribers right here on the Clips channel. If you want to support, please click that subscribe button. We're trying to get to 200k. Thank you. Thank you so much.